Yay, this is my room. Time to say goodbye to the pool and the pretty balcony and the pretty trees and the birds that start twerping at three o'clock in the morning. Hmm. Yeah, that was my tat. I got my tat. I know y'all like, but I need to wear something that um not rubbing, but the material I have, I can show y'all. On these pants are not like jean material, so I'm good. I'm good, 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 good. But yeah, it's not like jean material. It's really soft material and it's stretching, so it's not rubbing. Cause actually, the sore part is up here. But it's, I know if it's rubbing, it can. Um, where it can make it fade and stuff. But no, it's not, it's not rubbing. It actually feels fine. My shoulder feel good, the back of my head. It's a, oh, can I see it? It's a little sore. Some people would be like, I know the back of that head hurt. Did y'all see it? Let me bend down. I know some people are like, I know the back of that head hurt. No, it, it doesn't hurt. When she was doing it though, I ain't gonna lie. The little tender spot in the, right there in the middle of the top had me like a little shaky. But I didn't sweat or nothing. I was, I mean, I was good. She was like, good? I was like, like it hurt? I said, yeah, it hurt, but I'm all right. She was like, all right. And then um, she had the bottom of my head it's not that's actually not my neck that's still my head like the bottom hairline that's where i wanted that i didn't want nothing on my neck at all at all i ain't want nothing on my neck but yeah shoulder side back of the head but yeah time to go stuff packed up I'm about to close my bag put my computer into my other bag. I have a special bag for my computer and stuff. But yeah, I'm about to sit down, eat this breakfast they bought me. I gotta be out here by 12. So I gotta call for a pickup cause I do not like when they come knocking, knocking, knocking. You know, I'm like, nah, nah, nah. Even on your check out. Or even back home, check out. Chill out. I'm coming. <laughs> Let me show y'all what I'm eating. <laughs> I got that creme brulee again. Cause that mess was good. Then, of course, my black coffee with brown sugar. And then I got this, um, what is it? Um, pesto, it's pesto and tomato. Panini with mozzarella cheese. That's good. Cause sometimes I miss, sometimes I miss lunch like a lot. Cause I be doing things like at lunchtime. Like when I leave here, it will be lunchtime. So I will be missing lunch, and I'll either have a really late lunch, or won't have you know a lunch at all, just dinner. And then I got that orange juice again, y'all. I told y'all that orange juice is fine. And the main reason their orange juice is fire is because everything is naturally squeezed. Like that watermelon juice I have, naturally squeezed. They have like five, five or six other juices on there. But I wasn't happy with the orange juice, so I didn't want to take a chance on one. So yeah.
bad boy gone. All right, let me go ahead and eat and finish getting my stuff together. Oh, and their pillowcase have um, the initials LHGI on it. They told me to make sure I sleep on my side. I was sleeping on my side, y'all. I promise you I was. I usually do, but it's usually on my left side, which I can't sleep on my left side because the tattoo on this side. So I'll sleep on my right side, and I guess I end up turning onto my back. So, you know, when they see the pillowcase, they're like, what is this? And then, I got tired of laying on my left side. I mean, on my right side, I laid on my left side just for a little bit. This is when I was awake too, for a little bit. So, they got like a small little kind of a print of a uh, sunflower. <laughs> too. <They're> gonna... <laughs> uh, I'm sorry to mess up their white sheets. But luckily I'm not one of those tenants that leaves like the bed and everything just tore up. Like I actually like fixed everything up, you know? Covers are pulled back, towels are over there. I just always do that. Or I'll put them on the floor, but I ain't feel like it. But yeah, let me go eat. All right, y'all. Love you all. All right, y'all. So I made it to my next destination. I am in Simnyak now. And at my new place I will be staying. I am at the Tony's Resort, or Tony's Villas Resort. And let's go look around together. My room ain't ready yet. It's still gonna be about 30 minutes, so we can look around. <laughs> very cultural. Very, very cultural. Very, very cultural. Very pretty. You see these things on the ground? These right here, um, basically, it's like um, bring good spirits and worship and things like that. So if you're ever in Bali and you see it, do not step on it. It's actually very, very disrespectful. Very disrespectful. Okay. This is one of the restaurants. The other one is behind me downstairs. There goes one of the pools. Even though they said my tattoo, I ain't supposed to be able to get in it, so we'll see. Cool. Another pool. And I guess it's just more hallways and places to go. Alright. So that's all I can show right now. But when we get to my bungalow. I will show even more and we can see what the room looks like. Make sure it's nice and pretty like I had thought. Oh, let me show y'all this. See, this type of stuff is temple. Sanford is like temple stuff. Hey y'all, so I'm sitting like under, I don't want to call it, is it a gazebo like type thing? But not like no gazebo at, you know, back at home in America, you know, some cute shit, you know. You see it? And that's the other restaurant over there. But. I'm sitting right here until 
my bungalow is ready. Like I said, I got a bungalow. I didn't get a regular hotel room. So we about to see what this look like. And we about to say, make sure, you know, I'm big on it looking like how it looks on, you know, little, you know, video and stuff, you know, videos and the pictures that I see. That's what I, that's what I need to look like, okay? I know y'all, I know y'all with me. But, um, I had a good ride over here. My driver that I used today, he was really cool. One thing that a lot of drivers do around here, they also do tours too. So it's like, it's like really, really like trustworthy. I'm not saying just jump into anybody's car, you know, or any stranger. I actually booked him through an app as my driver. And then he let me know on the side that he does um, tours. And I had a few um, tell me, you know, that they do tours and things like that. And he um, was telling me that he do it. He pulled out the little paper. Sorry if the, it's getting dark. The sun and stuff and go, it's going out and I'm under the little gazebo thing. But um, I'm going to let him take me on a tour. I had a lot of people, you know, ask. And they were really nice people. I could have, and I, I feel kind of pretty. I'm like, I like my little my little rap rap I did with the little pins. I feel pretty. I shouldn't have did that like a monkey now. But um, I feel I feel really pretty, you know. But I like that he had like the paperwork and stuff like that, like to show me. The different things and let me pick where i want to go and then explain to me and as we even as we was driving like he was explaining like different temples as we were driving like other drivers when i was riding with them i would point and be like what's that over there and then they'll say it but they wouldn't be able to give me like history or tell me about it or just say oh that's the blah 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 he actually was just like oh that's the da 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 temple and this 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 and it's because of this because he's hindi and he was like you know, we believe in reincarnation, and like he gave me like all these different details, and the details that he gave me um, for the time that I'm going through in my life right now, um, he was explaining to me like how important spirits are to them, and how um, their rituals are, and the things that you know they do and they believe once the body passed and stuff like that and I almost started crying in the car but I kept, I kept the G I kept the G but I had a feeling the more and more I hang out with him he's gonna um he's gonna get to me but he don't get to me in a good way he don't know anything but everybody don't know everything that's happened with, with me but he's uh, I think he's gonna talk to me a lot and end up getting me you know to talk to him and tell me tell him some stuff so um but yeah i like him he's gonna pick me up early in the morning we're gonna go on some tours take some videos so y'all can see some more of bali bali and it'll be more cultural this one the next video is gonna be like more cultural there ain't gonna be no tattoos nothing like that but i i do have to go back to visit them because i'm getting something else it's a surprise um only two people know <laughs> but I'm getting something else because I don't care I'm doing what I want to do follow my heart ran across the world and I'm gonna keep on running where I want to run so love y'all talk to y'all later we are on the way to my bungalow my bag is heavy. They're so nice though.
hope they ain't trying to hope they ain't trying to do me like the back of the bus, you know. <laughs> yeah, I know what I mean. Oh, here goes another pool. Yay, this is my room. Okay. All right, y'all, this wind messing my poof up. I tried to do little, the little pins. I tried to make Venetia and Charmaine happy that I tried to do a hairstyle. I tried to do a hairstyle, but I got to comb it and repin it. But I'm about to go get something to eat. But first, let me show y'all this room. Y'all better quit. Y'all better quit playing now. Quit playing. So this one is like more like a considered like a garden, garden view. This is the way that we came from. Me and the gentleman that you saw walking. Here goes another path, and I think it leads to that pool that's over there. But this is my bungalow very beautiful beautiful doors y'all see those doors i also have it's a patio i have a sitting area so i would like to sit outside and stuff we are going to open these doors and this is my room be careful watch your step y'all watch your step don't fall you know don't trip can't have y'all tripping. I ain't got y'all on my travel insurance, all right? But it does come with a key. So when I leave, like, like the other place, I lock up. And then at night, this is how you lock the door. It goes in between here to lock your door. That's the TV. I don't know why they ever have a TV on for me. I don't watch TV, y'all. All I watch is YouTube. Look at the ceiling. It is so nice. It's so beautiful. This is my side view. I think it's somebody else over there. They might be seeing some booty booty if I don't close this. I don't know. They might have to see all the booty. Because I like the view. This is my room. They do have room service and things of that nature. This is my bed. This net is a um, mosquito net. It's to keep the bugs out. Cause I am in a bungalow, opening the door and closing the door. You can end up getting like mosquitoes. But I really haven't seen no flies, but I seen mosquitoes. This right here, that's the mini bar. I don't touch the mini bars. Like I told y'all, one, I don't drink beer and I don't drink soda. And two, I ain't paying for that shit. Excuse my language. Here goes the safe that I do put my passport in because I do believe you are supposed to put passports just in your safe. Just learn how to use it and put it in there. Do not walk around with it. Like I said, if you lose it, you shit out of luck until you talk to them, the embassy and all that stuff to get that set up. Then it comes with some mosquito stuff. So it's like mosquito um, cream. This right here, mosquito zapper. It goes inside here. He said I plug it in the wall. Like I said, I'm out here. Y'all see my scenery. Y'all seen the scenery. Here goes some towels and stuff. But there's no mosquitoes in here right now. So there's if I get mosquitoes, it's my fault. <laughs> Then this is my bathroom. So I had to open the door and go to another bathroom. That's just decoration. Toilet, like I said, I'm not gonna do a big old toilet view, because I, I don't know. Toilet is a toilet. Uh, shower. Let me see if I can find the light. Here we go. Here goes my indoor shower. Oh. Dang, I already told y'all a surprise. Okay, here goes the tub. I'm not a big tub person, but I like to have the beautiful tub. It's kind of kind of crazy, right? Like, Lorraine and I don't get in the tub. No, I just like to have the beautiful tub. I like the beautiful bathrooms. I can't afford this in America, so I'm gonna get the beautifulness. And then I have this area. 
Very pretty. Do y'all notice something? Oh, I can't do it on here. Y'all notice something though? That is an sh a shower. I have an outdoor shower. See? <laughs> that is so cool. So even if it rains, like the water and stuff will come in here, but it's set up that there's a drain, it won't get me or anything. So how do y'all like this room? Or excuse me, this bungalow. Did I do good? I think I did good. We walked through, he opened them first doors. I was like, ah. I said, I picked good. And he started laughing. He laughed at me so hard. But yeah, close that at night. Don't leave the bathroom door open, they said. But yeah, that's it, y'all. I'll show y'all the bed again. Because I think it's so, so nice. So nice. Look at it. Woo! Bali is such a great place. Spiritual peace. No matter if you come alone, it's fabulous as couple stuff. Could look at look at how they set these bedrooms and stuff, y'all. Each of these places I went, if you're with somebody, I I guarantee y'all would feel so good together. Like it would make you feel like you're in, you know, well you are in paradise. This is basically paradise. It's just a different paradise from Hawaii, Bahamas, Barbados, you know. It's a paradise that has spirituality with it. So, it's deeper. It's a very deep paradise. And I love it. So far, I love it so much. Tell y'all, I don't know. I might come back. Might pack it up. <laughs> Maybe this should be my home. Or maybe in a year, maybe I should have said, you know what? Especially if I'm not dealing with nobody and I don't got nothing going on. Maybe I should just get up and go. And move here, what y'all think? No, y'all can't visit me. I mean, y'all can come, but you get your own hotels, bungalows, villas, whatever. We'll meet up, we'll hang out. And then at night, you will go to where you're staying and I'm going to where I'm staying. You're not staying with me. <laughs> but alright y'all. So I'm about to go ahead and figure out what I'm about to eat. There's a lot of restaurants around me. I'm in Simnyak. So I got a lot. Like right down the street. Like right across the street. Like yeah. I think I'm going to do some organic stuff today. Yeah. Well, I do organic stuff anyway because all the stuff out here is good for you. Alright. Love y'all. This is the entrance into my resort. You have to drive through here to get to it. Pretty cool, huh? Make you feel special. Simnyak. Simnyak is a very busy place and it's like party central here they said. I guess it's like a lot of clubs, not a lot of nightlife, but they said it's not, somebody told me it wasn't safe to really be out at night, my driver told me, especially because I'm by myself. But I told him I'm not, I don't, I'm not coming to party, I'm not doing partying. I just want to do excursions and look at all the other stuff. But. All right, I'm about to walk in this restaurant. Let's go see what they got to eat. So I chose Cafe Organic. It's actually very beautiful in here. This is their menu. 
really, really big menu. I think my homegirl Tiffany will actually like this place. If she can actually read this menu, she's like, ooh, yes. But they have smoothies, coffees, teas, fresh juices, do yourself juice. Hmm. Well, I am going to pick what I want and then I'll let y'all see what I'm eating. And I'll tell y'all how it tastes. Okay. All right, love y'all. Bye. All right, I'm at Organic Cafe and I got Queen O' Rose. Pink Magic. It's like a fruit juice that they make. And then I got this beet burger. I want to be right with Vern. Yes. I will tear that up with you. <laughs> And it's right down the street from my um, hotel, my bungalow, which is a resort. And there's like tons of restaurants and everything on, like all around here. So it's pretty cool. This is like, literally, I wish y'all could see how close I am to where I'm staying. I didn't walk far at all. I'm about to eat. This is so good. Beets are good for you if you have low iron. But everybody that needs to know that. Because I can put low iron out there, especially me. But mine is so low that it's going to help me. This tastes good. <laughs> Yeah, I hate the sushi. They weren't that good. No flavor. Hey y'all, so I just got finished eating. organic and now I am about to just walk up and down the street a little bit check out what's going on I don't know if I should go to the left or go to the right which way y'all think that way or this way hmm let's figure it out or go to the right See if I can find me a place to eat dinner tonight. Boy, are these motorbikes, bruh. They about to take you out. A gourmet shop. Let's go to the gourmet shop. I decided on some treats. I couldn't help myself. I got two chocolate Danish. Something called a banana rum ball. I don't really like bananas like that, but still I'm gonna try. And a Canellas. 
that right there. And then I'm about to get two macarons. And I think this Bali cheesecake or the crunchy chocolate and lemon bar are probably even both because I'm greedy. Or I just get one and I can come back tomorrow because it's down the street. Like, not even a two minute walk. I'll be here for a couple days anyway. <laughs> yeah, man. And I don't feel full from the food I ate, so that's really good too. Excellent. Excellent late lunch choice. But now I can get dinner. This Street King restaurant look good, y'all, for dinner. I might be coming here for dinner. This guy, um, He's one of those people that basically, they ride like the scooters and give you rides and things like that. He told me he liked my style. He liked my tattoo that's in my head. <laughs> like, I like, I just stopped. I said, what? I didn't understand at first. And he was like, I like your style. I was like, oh, okay. I was like, thank you so much. Feeling my tat, feeling my tat. See, I thought people were gonna look at me like I was crazy. Maybe because I tried to do a little bun thing, but this wind blowing, so the bun's starting to stick up. But I walked pretty far away from my res my own um, mountain restaurant, my bungalow now. I'm about, hmm, long way down the street, maybe a mile down the street, maybe almost two. There's like restaurants in everywhere here in Simnac. It's a very, very busy place. Very busy. See? Look at the traffic. But like they're all going somewhere over there. I don't know if that's just another road or a place. I saw people walking from that way too. I got the camera closed. It's dark over here. There's no light. I'm sorry, guys. Who wants to watch a dark video? I mean, I can cut it off real quick until I get a little bit of sunlight and come back. Come back on y'all. Come back. <laughs> met this really nice European lady. And she was telling me, like, yeah, you went to the beach and stuff. And I was like, is it close by? Y'all yeah, know I've been walking for a while. She was like, yeah, it's right there. And I turned and it was like, it's, the beach is right here. So y'all, the hotel that I'm at, where my bungalow is, the beach is like a mile down the road. Like, not even a real walk. So, I'm going to the beach. We are at the beach. There's beaches everywhere and they're so pretty. And their steps are so steep. Goodness. The other one. There's a lot of stray dogs too, y'all. The stray dogs, they basically walk around how like the squirrels and stuff do at home. crazy how when you look at the sea it's like it doesn't end which I think it's crazy like there's no ending out there it's like it just keeps going I'm about to touch my feet <gasps> it's cold and no my toes still ain't done I'm gonna do that at the spa next week So yeah, so this beach I found out is, is called um, Simnyak Beach, where I'm staying. I'm in Simnyak now. And that's the name of the beach, this is Simnyak Beach. Y'all see my little anklet? 
that the ladies got me to buy. I'm wearing them. It looks cool though. I feel beachy, you know? I feel beachy. Now she get one of these stones. It's not, um, gosh, I forgot the name of that. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know back in school when we had, uh, what was that damn class called? Earth is science. And they brought all the shells, the different rocks. Remember, what kind of rock is this? This is limestone. This is this stuff. I forgot what those are called. That is actually called something. I forgot what it is. When I'm about to sit down. I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to sit on my shoes. But then I told him no, I was good. Like my hotel was like right there. But that was kind of flattering. He said he liked my style. I guess when he saw this chocolate sister, cause like I said, that other lady, well I didn't tell y'all. One lady that showed me the shell. Her name was Nicole. Um, she was Balinese. And she put her arm next to mine. And was like, our skin the same. We the same. By the knees, and I was just, I just laughed. <laughs> so, no, I'm a black sister, African American, whatever you want to call it. But y'all, I love a clean beach. This beach is so freaking clean. The other beach too was clean. It is crazy how clean. Younger than younger, younger, I used to go to um, Ocean City and Sandy Point up in back home when I was in DC. We used to ride out there to those beaches. But the cleanest beach I used to always see back home was um, Wrightsville out there in Wilmington. But y'all, y'all, you got, got that beach. These beaches are beautiful. So freaking clean and calm. I am literally sitting out here, regular clothes. I'm just sitting on top of my shoes and try to um, save myself from a little bit of the dirt. But one thing about the other beach was I didn't see no pelicans. There's a pigeon next to me, and I'm about to scream. I know when my brother sees this video, he's gonna laugh. It bet not. You better get away from me. I do not like birds, y'all. Y'all watch my six. Okay, watch my six. Cause I don't do birds. Here she come, they're trying to come sell to me. Watch. I bought some yesterday. Where? On the beach? Yeah, at Batu Belong. Yeah, okay. mm -hmm. Where you come from? Um, America. Yeah. You come by yourself? Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. For how long? Um, for about one week? No, longer than. Then 
dinner, y'all. I like how they got the name imprinted on the on a cement or concrete wall. Remember, it's the one I showed y'all earlier. I'm getting the Street King OG beef kebab with mozzarella cheese added. Comes with rice or french fries. I got rice and some sweet potato chips. Hair all messed up now. Look, Laverne is out late walking the streets. It's pretty cool out here though. But I'm on the way home, just picked up my dinner. Didn't want to eat at the hotel restaurant tonight. I want to try more restaurants outside the hotel restaurant. So I can say I had more Balinese food. I had more Indonesian food. I had more culture food. All right, y'all. Like I got sand all over me, and I promise y'all I wasn't in the water because I put my bag down. I put my bag back over my um my shoulder, but I just wanted to say I am back home. Well, this is this is yeah, this is my home. I am back home. I am home now, and I am about to take a shower. I had a good time walking up and down the street. Man said so he like he like my style. He must think I'm a street walker with this blonde hair and tattoo in the back of my head. But um, these are the treats I got. Okay, y'all cannot talk about me because I was sitting on the beach, okay? And I wanted to have a snack. I got two macaroons. Um, one is chocolate and one is pistachio. That pistachio one is off the chain. Chocolate one is, uh, it's all right. Yes, half of each is gone because I took a bite. And then I have this banana ball, rum ball, or something like that. Yes, half of that is gone because I took a bite. <laughs> and then this right here, I forgot what it's called, but I took a bite. <laughs> and this is um, Bali cheesecake. And yes, I took a bite. It was good though. You know, I was on the beach. I had, you know, I had to. Had a snack on the beach, you know. Then I also got the um <laughs> the chocolate Danish. I actually bought two. And yeah, go ahead and say it with me. I took a bite. Well, really, that I <laughs> really <laughs> that wasn't even a bite. I ate the whole damn thing, but I left one. <laughs> I know y'all like Laverne. But you on the beach. When you on the beach, you're supposed to have snacks or like the little picnic basket or something. Like I wasn't swimming. I was just watching the water and trying to talk, text on whatever on my, not text, but you know, talk on my phone. I'm on like Facebook and stuff like that. But it was acting kind of slow. Made me mad. And then people were writing back slow. I need y'all to write back faster. I don't care if you sleep, wake up. Wake up and come talk to me when I wanna talk. Who cares if we're in different time zones? Who cares? Hmm? Let's talk. <laughs> now nah, it's messing. Y'all sleep, y'all sleep. But uh, I'm gonna take a shower to get this um, dirt off of me. But it gotta be a quick one because, and I feel like I have dirt on this, but like I said, all my tattoo people out there that gets tattoos all the time, help me out here. Is that just the peeling I'm feeling? I feel like it's dirt, but, I, but maybe it's just the peeling. Cause it's only, I only feel it on top of the, the whatchamacallit. So, yep. I'm about to wash it up, wash it up, wash it up, and lay down and get on my computer. 
Oh, and talk some junk on Facebook. I would say on Instagram too, but I don't talk junk on Instagram. I ain't talk junk on Facebook because that's where all the people are. I know all the friends and stuff I went to school with and college it, college, college with, be at. So, you know, I be talking junk to them or with them or laughing at their junk. So, yep. I'm back. Charmaine, Venetia, I made my little pen style stay pretty good. Eh, eh, eh. I'm pretty good. But I showed y'all my desserts, like I, like I said. I already showed y'all my dinner. No, I'm not about to open it and stuff. I showed y'all the picture, okay? I showed y'all the picture, I'm tired. And I gotta get up early and go do this tour. This guy better give me a really good tour too. Cause if he don't, I told him I will not, uh, what is it called? Uh, refer him to anybody if they decide to come out to Bali. But if he's good, I'm gonna refer her, refer her, refer him to everybody because he knows so much of the culture. He's, you know, has little age on him, not too old, not too old, not too young, just, you know, like perfect. Like one of them people that be like, you know, my dad used to, you know, one of those. So hopefully I'm gonna have a good time. Post, we're supposed to start at like nine o'clock. Woo! They supposed to be like a whole day thing. And then I was invited to like, it's like this black community thing of black people out here. Cause I met this girl the other day when my phone kept messing up. She took me like, walked me to like a Wi-Fi spot. And she was telling me about it. She was like, yeah, cause there's not many people out here that's black. So they have like, I forgot what she called the community. Like they try to get all the black people together that's out here. And they be like doing stuff or they be having to like get together and stuff. She invited me to one. Um actually tomorrow at four o'clock. She was like, Russell Simmons be out there. And I was about to say, Ain't Russell Simmons hiding from the um the popos right now out here? Because Russell Simmons is in Bali. I don't know if y'all remember that. They said they don't know if he ever gonna come back. Unless y'all know some new stuff. But he's in Bali ever since that Me Too stuff. They said he dipped out and went to Bali. So he's here, but he's supposed to be a part of that little group too, or he'd be at the little parties, get together and stuff. But, um, I thought I saw some of my box. But yeah, if I finish in time, or when I finish, is she still, they're still going and having their get together still, then I will go. I'll have my driver drop me off there and then get a ride back. But um, if not, if this, if this really is an all day adventure, Vern ass ain't going. They got to find me tomorrow. I mean, that next day. Cause I came out here to see Bali, not the party. I'm just going out here to meet this black folk people um, group. Because y'all know, like I said, if I move to Bali, I need to know what's going on. So if I decide to hang with the Balinesians, the Indonesians, or the black people, or the Europeans that live here, I need to know who I would hang with, who I wouldn't hang with. Or go ahead and pick my friends now, you dig? All right, love y'all. Love y'all, it's late here. It's 7.09 p.m. right now on the 12th. So let me wash it down, wash it down. Wash, 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 wash. Love you all.